always about the students. So all of you here that work for Coastal and you work with students, please continue. It's all about them, never about us. I told Ms. Pat when I met with her, in your last year at Coastal Carolina, we're going to make this year all about you. <laughs> so as a result, that's what today is about, is celebrating you. When I say the name Pat Singleton Young, thousands of students know who that is, don't they? Unfortunately, yes. Yes, yes. Yes. Um, in thousands fact, of them. I started thinking about the numbers of those, Pat. You've been here for 38 years. 38. Mm -hmm. And how many years were you here as an undergrad? Four. Four. So more than 40 years. Yes. You graduated, and then this was your first real job. I started out as an assistant director for student activities. And where are you now? Right now I'm director of multicultural student services. This is the first time in six years that I, I'm only doing one, one thing. thing. When I first started, I was so close to the age of the students. Um, there were times when it was hard uh, for the students to take direction. It's like, well, you're 24, why should I do what you asked me to do? Then I went through a period of where students understood who I am, what I'm supposed to be doing. Um, they reacted well. Um, they were eager. Today, I think our students are a little bit different and it's harder to pull things out of them. So I spend more energy Yes. Investing in the one-on-ones, saying, you've got so much potential. Why are you not doing this, this, and this? So, um... Well, they end up doing it. If they get a little Pat Singleton Young, they end up doing they it. They end up doing it, yes. There are so many students through the years that I am just so proud of. I've got doctors, medical doctors, and I say I, yes, because I yes, touch their lives, yes, so they yes, belong to yes, me. Yes. Oh, um, I've got doctors, I've got dentists, I've got um, people who started their own businesses. The gamut is just so, so wide. But what I'm most proud of is watching that student cross the stage. Mm -hmm. That's what it's all about. It's about the student and them graduating. No students, no jobs. That's, it is that simple but sometimes people forget that. Yeah. I, I said that to the Board of Trustees um, at their last meeting. Um, in fact, at that last meeting, what did they tell you at that last meeting that was a surprise? It was a surprise. I was asked to say a few words. Um, at that point, I say whatever, and the last thing I say is remember it's all about the students. And all of a sudden you hear, Mr. Chairman, I make a motion that we name um, a building in honor of Pat Singleton Young. Second, it happened just that quickly. I don't think I've ever seen a motion go through so fast. It was like my head was spitting. Couldn't figure out what was happening. Voted so the on Pat Singleton Young something. Um, residence, residence Hall. Residence Hall. Absolutely. Yes. Pat, have you seen, have you ridden by the residence halls? Do you know which one? I did not. However, <laughs> I know now. The naming of uh, the residence halls is a major honor, and I'm just humbled by it. Uh, what has stayed the same about this campus? Of course, when we were small, we knew everybody. We knew everybody's children, grandchildren, yeah. et cetera, and, and it was really, really family. Um, even if we're larger today, there's still some semblance of family. What would you like to see happen here after you leave? I'm hoping that all of those, the time and effort that I've put in, that those programs stay around um, and continue to benefit students. Okay, I also want to talk about your um, retirement reception. Ooh, that was fun. Yeah, tell me about that. That was fun. I was surprised at the number of people that showed up. It was very, very nice. Um, I, I don't know how many people they prepared for, but it was just amazing. Or anything left to say that you've never said? No, we won't do that. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> well, we will say um, that it's been 38 years of working with students and it has kept me young. We love you. Yes. And um, we appreciate every single ounce of energy in life that you have given this place. Yeah.